Greetings and welcome to our information video about the SMA Energy System Home. In this video we would like to present how to set up, install and commission the SMA Energy System Home. For your safety, please observe all safety information in the manuals for each individual components at all times. We will show you an example of how to configure a PV inverter, a battery inverter with a battery storage system and an SMA data logger to create an energy system that works perfectly. Now let's introduce our example system. First, here we have our PV inverter Sunnyboy 6.0. This inverter makes sure that the direct current from the PV array is converted into grid-compliant alternating current. In order to convert the direct current supplied by the battery into alternating current that can be used in the grid, we use the Sunnyboy Storage 5.0. It also makes sure that the battery is charged and discharged. This brings us to our next component, the battery. Here we use an HVS 6.4 battery box with 5 battery modules. And last but not least, the Sunny Home Manager 2.0. This device is responsible for energy management in your SMA energy system. Before you install your energy system home, choose a suitable place to install the components. We recommend a central installation site. Please observe the installation requirements that are shown in the manuals for the individual components. Here are some tips to begin with. The internet router you use should support address assignment, DHCP. This makes it easier to commission the devices. For smooth operation, choose a purely wired communication link instead of a wireless link. If the physical situation on site does not allow this, you can of course also set up a communication connection with Wi-Fi or Powerline PLC. However, not every PLC adapter can be used for this communication. Please avoid using a combination of wired communication and wireless communication. If you need to use a network switch for your installation, prefer one of the models listed here to ensure technically smooth operation. Please refer to the related technical information which you can find in the SMA download area. Some battery firmware updates are transferred directly through the Sunnyboy storage. Others must be transferred using particular tools of the battery manufacturer. Before commissioning the Sunnyboy storage, make sure that the battery has the minimum firmware version. You can also find this information in the download area. SMA uses the standard configuration of the battery usage areas. For recommendations on specific batteries, please contact the particular battery manufacturer. Sunny Home Manager 2.0 needs Sunny Portal to perform its tasks correctly. A system must be defined there so that the configuration, monitoring and energy management can be carried out. Make sure that only the Sunny Home Manager is registered in the portal with its PIC and RID. The Home Manager then registers the other components itself. Please keep in mind that all devices within the system require the same installer password. Set this password to the same value when you commission the individual devices later. This password is also the system password used by Sunny Portal and the one that must be entered when you register the system. Please make a note of this system password now. You will need it several times later on. Enable the automatic firmware updates on all system components. Make sure that the parameter Operating Mode Active Power Default is set to the value External Set Point for all inverters. If you change the country data set of the inverters, it is possible that an internal firmware update will be performed. This takes a few minutes. After that, the inverter is ready for operation again. Before commissioning, please obtain information on the connection conditions of your grid operator. Now we come to installing the individual components. This diagram shows the electric circuit. First, install the Home Manager 2.0. Be sure to install the device in the correct direction. Always install the Home Manager behind the energy meter and the input fuse of your grid operator and before the main distribution board of your house. This way you measure all the loads and generators in the household. The installation manual and the operating manual will give you a detailed description of how to install the Sunny Home Manager 2.0. You can find the manuals themselves in the download area of the product page. The next step is to install the Sunnyboy storage. For this matter, we've prepared a detailed video for you to watch. Follow the link to get useful tips on how to install your Sunnyboy storage. Next, install your batteries. When you click on this link, you will see the technical information, approved batteries and information on the battery communication connection. 
It gives you an overview of compatible batteries for the Sunny Boy storage, information on how to coordinate the battery with the Sunny Boy storage and other helpful tips. In the final step, install the Sunny Boy. We have a detailed video with valuable tips on this topic too. To access this video, click the field to the right. Now we come to commissioning the individual components. To do this, you first need to have switched on the devices as described in the installation manuals. Now you need a laptop or PC with internet access. For wired access, the laptop must be in the same network as the devices. After a short startup time, you can access the Sunny Boy and the Sunny Boy storage from their web service. The Sunny Home Manager 2.0 can be accessed via the Sunny Portal. Now you can start commissioning your PV inverter. To do this, access the website of the device by entering the IP address of the device. This access can be wired or by a direct Wi-Fi connection. The various options are explained in the installation manual. Then log in as an installer on the user interface of the inverter by entering the system password you set earlier and make the necessary settings. By clicking the button on the right, you can watch a video that helps you with the commissioning process. Now we show you how to commission the Sunny Boy storage. To do this, call up the website of the device in the same way as you did for Sunny Boy. Log in with the installer password you set earlier and then check the display of the battery's state of charge. If this is not displayed, please check the wiring and configuration of the battery first. Configure the rest of the functions of the device only after checking this. You can also use the video by clicking on the field on the right to get more useful tips. You can now do the basic system commissioning with the Sunny Home Manager 2.0 and the Sunny Portal. You have now set up the system in Sunny Portal. This is an example installation. If you have other system constellations, you can follow a similar procedure. You can now add more directly communicating devices, such as an SMA EV charger or other supported smart home devices. Take a look at our new apps, such as the SMA 360 degree app, which is designed for installers, and the SMA Energy app, which has end users as its target group. Please also follow our wide range of video tips. You can find them on our YouTube channel SMA Solar. We hope you have enjoyed this overview. Thank you for watching.